Hey you guys, so welcome back to another Vlogmas. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys what I got my tween daughter. So I know that this video is well overdue. I promise you to get it out sometime way back in November. So hopefully you guys are still able to pick out some of these items. If you guys have a tween daughter, niece, granddaughter. So this video is going to be like a tween haul or what I picked up or bought for her. Um, so I do have a almost 12 year old. Uh, my daughter is 11. She'll be 12, eight weeks right after Christmas. She is at that age where she still loves to play with dolls, but she is into all of the girly girl stuff. So without further ado, we are going to start with clothes. So I'm going to show you everything that I picked up that um, she can wear. This is from Target. I did pick her up some jeans. So I am planning on doing Soraya whole wardrobe over, especially for the winter. So I did want to start off with replacing a lot of her jeans. So I did get from the Wild and Fable um, brand. I got her some a really cute jeans that has like the cuts in it and they are um high-waisted but i thought that this was really cute um they do have the straight legs at the bottom um so i got her them in blue i also picked her up some in black and this is the high rise and they still have the cuts in the pants as well i thought that that would be cute with some sneakers or some boots i also got them in like a black wash as well um do these have any cuts no these are just regular straight leg but she can always dress this up or down um throw on a graphic tee with them so I did pick that up. Okay, so this is not out of the plastic yet, but I'm gonna put up a picture of what this is. It's actually the Snuggie. Um, it's kind of like a robe. I did mention this over in my tweens wish list, but I did get it in purple and it is super soft, you guys, really soft. So I did get that, this, Steve and Madden's and this is a crossbody bag so this is her very first crossbody and it is Steve Madden and it also come with a earbud case I thought that this was really cute it's so funny because when we go into stores like Marshall's or Ross and she sees Steve Madden and typically it abbreviated the s and the m those are her initials so she be like that is for me because it is s and m so <laughs> she told me that recently looking at this bag and i'm just like okay i'm gonna get it so this is her first steve madden's crossbody i thought it was cute it's basic it's plain it's black um and you know it's really good quality it's a really great gift set so i did pick that up for her i think that's pretty much all for clothing right now um like i said i am revamping out her wardrobe so i am going to be doing like a winter clothing haul for her and try on video so definitely if you guys are not subscribed make sure you are subscribed have your notifications on so you don't miss out on any videos that I post so yeah that one is going to be coming up too so that's all I pretty much got her for clothing now let me show you what I picked up shoes wise so I did get her these really pretty comfortable smiley slippers they do come with some just a pair of smiley face socks I thought that that was really cute and unique but this is what they look like it has the purple on there i thought they was really simple and cute and comfy 
they have a sale on all of their Nikes right now. I went in there with the intentions of just finding her some sneakers to wear. And I literally put my hands on these um, Nikes that on the box is say it was for $89.99. When I went up to the register girl, it rung up for $39.99. $30. $40. So if you got a Dix and you looking for some really good Nike sneakers, they have all of the Nikes. Um, definitely check them out because a lot of their stuff is on sale right now. So these are the um, Air Maxes that I got her. They are one of the chunky sneakers. She really is into the chunky sneaker look right now. So I did pick these up. It's like a um, rose gold and light blush pink. And they are so cute. Um, so I did get her a pair of Nikes. Um, I am going back to get her a few more pairs. Because like I said, you cannot beat it being $39, especially right now, you would think that it's way more. Like I stated, she is at that age where she still play with Barbie dolls. So she wanted this LOL Tweens doll. This one here caught her eyes because of the hair half and half. So this one here is Grace Skates and she's cute she's so adorable so i did get her one of those um where's the other one? Oh. i also got her one of the um lol omg sunshine makeovers now this doll is supposed to color change in the sun so i did get her this one um i thought she was so cute um i i don't know i really want to get her another one but I, I think i'm done so yeah i got this one but they they are all cute like the whole entire line was so adorable so i just picked her up one um these are the mini brands i told you guys she absolutely is in love with these right now um these was $9.99 you definitely can catch them on sale you guys at Ross Burlington's and Marshall so definitely check them out if your kiddos or your tweens really love these mini brands so I got her this this is series five I got her this is the foodie mini brands one and this is series two each one comes with two balls of them and then I got her series four. It's a mini verse. Um, these are mini foods that she can actually make using resin. Now you definitely have to be cautious because as you guys know, resin is used a lot in the DIY or jewelry craft type of um, field so you definitely have to be a lot cautious with resin but it's really fun so I had them before um, she knows the do's and don'ts when it comes to resin but it's definitely a really fun experience so this is the pack that has just all the foods in there that she can make I also got the um, the make it mini kitchen and now this also comes like with food in there as well but not like a lot and then what i really like is that the stove is also a uv lamp so as you guys know with resin it has to be set out into the sun in order for it to harden right but the stove has a built-in uv lamp on the inside which it's really good and you can put it automatically just in the stove and it'll cook less than five minutes. I really love poppets. Now these are two of them actually come in the box. They are glow in the dark poppets and I thought that 
these are so adorable she collects these and she has so many different ones from food to different designs when i saw the llamas i thought that they were so cute and i have other poppets as well but i think i'm going to put it in her stocking stuffer so be on the lookout for that video coming right after this one as well but i thought that these was extremely adorable so i did get those okay i'll show these first so i went to one of our local bookstores and i purchased her tons of books um i really am big on splurging more on the educational side than the toy side but that's just me so I didn't mind really getting tons of books for her she is into diary of a wimpy kid right now so instead of buying like the entire collection because I know she reads them super fast she'll be done with them and bored with it and just be sitting around her room so I just picked her up three of them so I got her this one here which is the long haul i got her the getaway and then the third wheel and then i got her the babysitter's club um she's read tons of the babysitter club series um except for this one this one here is jesse's secret language where she teaches a sign language so she really wanted that one but i think all the other um series she have read as well um i also picked her up the collection of reina telemeyer i hope i'm pronouncing her last name right if not i'm sorry but um she really loved her books um we she first was introduced to these when she went to the library last year in our home school so when she read it she's like i have to have it on my in my bookshelf so she wanted this collection so i got her smile um guts sisters And the last one is drama. So I did pick those books up for her as well. Um, we really love a really good family night board game. So I did want to get tons of the classics and some new board games to play. So we are going to be playing the uno attack and i thought that this one would be really fun um we never played this we played the classic card you know the uno cards but we never tried that one before so i know she'll be excited for that because the regular one was on her list but i really want to try this one i know she'll like it I also got her Mancala. Like, who remember playing Mancala? This was my favorite game in middle school. So she really wanted to play this. I got her this a long time ago when she was much younger. And I don't know what happened to it. But she absolutely loved, when she got the hang of it, she, she loved Mancala. So she asked for a new one. And then she actually picked this one out, the worst case scenario card game. So it's basically a bunch of scenarios, the worst case of scenarios, and it just it picks your brain, see how you know your thought process is, is what you would do in this type of scenario type. So I thought that this would be really fun to just see what she would do if these scenarios actually occurred. So I did pick that up. I thought it'd be really fun to like see how her thought process is, how quick she can react to certain, you know, scenarios. I thought that was a good idea. And then I also bought Clue. And that is another classic 
fun board game. So first and foremost, Soraya wants to do a room makeover. She's getting older, so she wants her room to be more of a teen's room. So I did look into getting her a whole new bed set. I am going to enter a picture of the type of bed that she picked out and I ordered it. So of course, I wouldn't have been able to show that in today's video, but you guys will get an idea of what I ordered. So I am going to be making over her room. So I did get her a brand new bed. Um, that is one of her gifts. The next one here, I told you guys about the star projection light. That is that one here. And this is what it does. So it will literally light up her whole room galaxy. So if you have someone who's interested in like the galaxy scenario, this definitely would do it. it it's very beautiful and i absolutely love all the videos that i've seen so far about it um i also got her a butterfly led vanity mirror now this was actually at five and below um i've seen of the really huge vanities and we are contemplating on moving so i didn't want to like do like a really big vanity and have to bring it back down so i thought that a mini one for right now would be really good and it lights up led and it's a butterfly so it's extremely cute again they have them at five and below these are all of the makeup bags and they are so cute for makeup and this one says stuff skin so skincare um hair and then face so it's a really great organizational tool um or bags just to keep everything all in one place so i thought that that would be a really great idea as well and what i really love about this is look how big they are you guys like she could fit tons of all of her face product skincare that she used um and regular stuff can go in this one but they're extremely huge for the amount so you're definitely getting good quality for the amount that you're paying for now i'm going to enter a picture of what this is this is an actual boba um squishmallow she's been really wanting a squishmallow and she loves boba so both of the things that she really loves combined it is so cute and i love it so i'm going to enter a picture here i know for a fact that she's going to love this and you guys it is so huge i think it's like 24 inches maybe i'm not sure but i am going to pop this open like um christmas eve and when i am like um wrapping everything i'm gonna pop this open and have it expand but it is really big it's soft and when I saw this on Amazon, I just knew she had to have it. These are travel jewelry sets. So in this big one here, she can put her um, like necklaces and things into there, to the container. And then she also have, um, she also have one for rings so all of her jewelry she's able to put in these so i thought that they were really cute and again it's organization which is key for me <laughs> anything that can definitely help have something all in one place i'm i'm definitely for it and it's stylish it's cute it has her initial on there cute and then i think the rest of the stuff is kind of like electronic i did get her a portable karaoke machine so and this is like ld led so it do like lights up is wireless but soraya really loves singing singing is her thing she goes around the house singing. She's singing in the shower. She just, she, she loves singing. So I thought a karaoke machine for her would definitely be ideal. So, um, yeah, I picked that up for her. 
I did get this from a five and below two. It's a four in one electronic spa. Now she wanted the purple one. I didn't see the purple one. I probably should have ordered it on Amazon, but I saw this one for cheaper. So I did go with this one. Um, and it pretty much do everything that the other one do. It's just in a really pretty teal color, which I'm pretty sure she would mind. She just wanted the brush to just have it to wash her face with. So I'm pretty sure she wouldn't mind that there is teal and it's cute some headphones now she was in need of these um, especially during our homeschool hours when she is doing her math and all her other online subjects um, having headphones is definitely helpful so I thought that this would be beneficial especially for when she want to listen to music and also do her work online so I did get this in like a really pretty blush pink. I have to explain this because it would make sense if I if I don't. So Soraya is really into doing YouTube videos. She has been watching me do YouTube since she was five. I've been on and off YouTube. This is my brand new channel, but I've been literally on YouTube since she was five years old. She's been seeing me sit in front of the camera and interacting with interacting with you guys to the point where she wanted to create her own YouTube channel. Now, I never mentioned this on my channel, but she do have her own YouTube channel, a kid's YouTube channel, where she is unboxing toys, she's doing slime, she's doing like day in the lives, vlogs, she, she does it all. She pretty much does all the little kid fun things, the videos. So she really wanted to be more consistent this upcoming year. So I thought to get her all of her equipment that she is going to need to be successful. So the first thing I did pick her up is this Studio Creator. Now this is a 360 face motion ring light. And it comes with a ring light. It also comes with an adjustable tripod. The ring light do light up. Like I said, it rotates 360 accordingly to where she moves. It, so it comes with the ring light that adjusts in tons of different colors. She also get a tripod and she also get the smartphone holder as well. So she get all of that in this Studio Creator Kit here. She also get a green screen, it looks like, um, that she can change out like the background all in this box here now when i got all of my equipment of course everything came individually and it was pretty expensive so i thought that with everything like a starter kit so this is kind of like a starter kit and it's used for TikTok, youtube and instagram so if you have a tween that's interested in doing any of those things um i definitely highly recommend getting them one of these and to go along with that i did end up buying her her own 4k digital camera now i know you guys are thinking like that's expensive this was only one something on amazon you guys compared to i have the sony zv1 i also had the canon g7x those are about 800 900 dollars per camera compared to that this one here is very affordable and this is a real camera it's 4K, it's a digital camera, like I stated, um, and it shows really, I mean, crystal clear. I feel like it's like a beginner vlogging type camera. It pretty much has the same features as my Sony v, uh, ZV-1. So I'm so excited for her to try this out to see if she actually like it. I think it, it's gonna be a really fun gift for her. She's gonna be really excited and really feel like she is a vlogger. And then the last, really, I saved it for last because it's, it's pretty expensive, you guys. Um, but I did get her a Nintendo Switch. Now she's been really wanting this for a really long time and I have been debating on if I wanted to get it because these things is about 300 something dollars. Okay, so if 
very expensive but I kind of figured that it would definitely be beneficial for her and for our homeschool as well now the reason I say that is because they have tons of fitness games now I'm thinking when winter actually approaches it rains because in Cali when it rains it pours I knew that we wouldn't be able to go outside to do PE so I thought to like get her this and get her like some PE games or some exercising fitness games so we can use it so that is the only reason why I invested in this. And like I said, this was pretty expensive. It's kind of like more expensive than everything that I purchased here today. But um, overall, Sarai is a really good kid. Um, so she's been doing really well, especially in our homeschool um, and at home as well. So I definitely think that she deserves a lot of the items that she received here today and this is kind of like a one in a lifetime thing she typically get all this stuff at the end of the year like this this is not like a constant every month type gift you know so this is the only time she typically get this stuff for a game to go along with it she wanted the just dance game now i know you guys really can't tell that it say just dance but I, I ordered this from Walmart and you know guys know when it is um for pickup they have your name and everything on the front but this is just dance this is the 2024 edition now the Nintendo do come with the Mario Karts deluxe online um so you know she has two games such everything that I bought Soraya for Christmas like I said I'm going to leave everything linked in the description box down below if you guys are interested in getting some of these items but be on the lookout for a stocking stuffer gift guide I didn't show you everything that I got for her stocking stuffer so that's going to be a part two of this series I would say you guys enjoyed this video and I will catch you guys in the next one bye